How do you feel there? I'm really scared. I'm scared. You feel young or old? Young. Younger than t than 10? Yes. Mm -hmm. How old do you feel there? Two. Mm -hmm. You feel male or female? Female. Female. Mm -hmm. Describe this place that you're in. It's really dark. Mm -hmm. And I feel like really warm. Feel really warm. Once you describe your what you're wearing. My dress. A dress? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Look at your skin. What color is your skin? Looks pale. Pale? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. In this place, how are you positioned? Are you sitting, standing, walking? Sitting. Sitting. And what are you sitting on? Porch. Porch. Mm -hmm. What do you notice around you on this porch? Bees. Bees. Mm -hmm. Where are these bees? They're all around. Mm -hmm. And how do these bees make you feel? Nervous. Nervous. Mm hmm. And this porch that you're sitting on, this place, describe it. It's like a cabin, like a wooded place. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And is this somewhere that you live or are you visiting? Live. Mm hmm. And who do you live there with? Man. With who? A man. A man? Who is this man? Cousin. Cousin? How old is your cousin? 54. 54. Mm -hmm. Anyone else that live with you and your cousin? Auntie. Mm -hmm. Anyone else? No. Mm -hmm. And what's your auntie's name? Lawrence. Lawrence? Florence? Yes. Mm -hmm. How old is your auntie Florence? 72. Mm -hmm. And your cousin, what's his name? John. John. Mm -hmm. And what do they call you? What's your name? Emily. Emily. Emily, where do you live? I don't know. Where is this place where this house is located? Where do you live? In the country. In the country. What year is it? Seventeen sixty three. Seventeen sixty three. Mm -hmm. And so, how do you feel there, Emily? You, you feel. How do you feel about them um, living there? In that place with your your aunt and your cousin. Safe. So safe. Mm -hmm. um, where are your parents, Emily? They're dead. Mm -hmm. How did they die, Emily? By accident. By accident. How old were you when they died? Baby. Mm hmm. How does that make you feel? I 
Non. Non. Mm -hmm. And so, Emily, you're sitting there on this porch, on looking at these bees all around, feeling nervous. Tell me what's happened next as you're sitting there. It's really quiet. Mm -hmm. It's quiet. Anything stand out to you about this place? Anything else? It's really, really quiet. Mm -hmm. Is it normal for it to be that quiet? Is it always that quiet? No. Mm -hmm. What do you usually hear there? Cars. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so as you're hearing, it's really quiet, unusually quiet. What thoughts are going through your mind? Afraid. Repeat that. I'm afraid. Afraid. Afraid of what? The car is just coming. Mm hmm. You said you don't hear any cars and you're afraid of the cars that's coming? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And what cars the, that are coming? It's the people that's coming. The people. Who's coming? Mm. You know, it's, it's like horses. Mm hmm. You're traveling on horses? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And so tell me what happens next. You come into the house. They come to the house? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Are you alone there at the house or are there your aunt and your cousin there with you? They're in the house. They're in the house. What are they doing in the house? Praying. Praying. Mm-hmm. And these people that came to the house, how many are there? Five. Mm -hmm. Describe these people. White. Mm -hmm. Older. Mm -hmm. Kind of rough hair. Mm -hmm. Rough looking hats. Mm -hmm. Oh, and these people come, what do they do? What did I say? Told me to come here. Mm hmm What thoughts go through your mind when they uh, tell you that? I don't feel safe. Mm hmm And what happens next? They call me a nigger girl. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm And how does that make you feel? Ashamed. Mm -hmm. Ashamed. Ashamed because? I don't understand why they call me a nigger girl. Mm -hmm. And what happens next? Start to cry. Mm -hmm. And what happens next? They throw me down. Repeat that. They throw me down. Repeat that. They just threw me down. They threw you down. Someone comes and picks you up and throws you down. Is that what you mean? Yes. Mm -hmm. Describe this person. 
on the black hat. There's a, a beard that's like red hair beard. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He has like this grin. He's like grinning. Mm-hmm. When you connect with this man's energy, tell me if you recognize his energy as anyone in your current life. I don't know this man. Mm-hmm. So what happens next? He throws you down. What happens next? I cry louder. Mm-hmm. And what thoughts are going through your mind as you cry? I want my mom. Repeat that. I want my mom. It's your mom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And what happens next? My auntie comes. Mm-hmm. Describe your auntie. She has braids. Mm-hmm. She has white hair. Mm-hmm. He's brown. Mm-hmm. And she's kind of heavy. Mm-hmm. What happens? She comes. What happens next? Comes out with the broom. Be that? Comes out with the broom. Mm hmm. And she bows down, starts crying. Mm hmm. And why is she crying? If she just wants them to leave. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And what happens next? You keep saying, please leave, please leave. Mm-hmm. Does your aunt know these people? Yes. Mm-hmm. How does she know them? Says master. Repeat that. She calls him master. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. When she tells them, ask them to leave, what do they say anything? He hit her. Mm-hmm. Where did he hit her? Her face. Mm-hmm. What happens next? Blows her by her hair. Mm-hmm. And drags her. Mm-hmm. I'm crying. Mm-hmm. I'm just so crying, I'm so scared. And mm-hmm. I just cry and I'm crying and I'm crying. Mm-hmm. Let me speak with this man. I want to speak with this man. I want you to lend your mind and lips to this man. And I can snap my fingers in a moment. I want you to lend your mind and lips and allow this man to express himself. Three, two, one. Hello there, sir. What do you want? Well, that's what I'm trying to figure out. What what's going on with you? What do you want? Why are you there at these uh, fine folks' house? They got work to do. Work? What kind of work does she need to do? <laughs> Shine my shoes. Shine your shoes. Mm. And that and requires for you to hit her and beat up the child and pull her by hair. That's what we're supposed to do. 
That's what you're supposed to do. Hmm. And why is that what you're supposed to do? That's what my pa taught me. Uh Oh, your pa taught you that. I see. So, uh, what do you do for a living? Do you work at all, sir? I watch niggers. Okay. You watch niggers, and that's your job. All right. And when you watch these fine people that you're referring to as niggers, who do you, uh, do you typically report to someone about this? My like paw. Your paw. Okay, gotcha. How old are you? Seventeen. What's your name? You call me Ray. Ray. All right, Ray. So you want her to shine your shoes, and so you come there with a commotion. Apparently, you don't. Never mind. Let me speak with um, Emily, please. Three, two, one, Emily. All right, Emily. Tell me what happens next. They pull your aunt from the, uh, the porch and by the hair. What happens next? Get scared. Hate that? I just I get really scared. Mm hmm And what's happening there with your aunt and the the man, the little boy rather? It's two of them. It's it's more than the two of them are being mean. And what are the uh, what are the others doing? I just laugh and spit. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And what happens next there, Emily? They laugh and they write off. Mm hmm. And what thoughts go through your mind as you're seeing all of this? I can't understand what's going on. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. What happens next? My auntie just lay there and cry, and I just lay on her. Mm -hmm. What do these men do? Do they leave? Do they stay? Stay? What happens? What happens to them? They leave. Mm -hmm. When they leave, does your aunt go with them, or does she stay with you? She stays. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what happens next? She just hugs me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what happens next? Going to the house. Okay. All right. All right, Emily, go ahead. Close the scene. Close the scene, Emily. I want you to go to the very next important event in that same lifetime as Emily, where something important is happening. Another day in that lifetime as Emily, where something important is happening. I'll count from three to one. When I get to one, you'll be in that next important event. Three, two, and one. Where are you? What's happening? It's like in? I'm Go in ahead. a town. 
in a town. It's like a lot of people. Mm-hmm. How old do you feel there? Twenty six. Twenty six. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Tell me more about this town with lots of people. What else do you notice there? There's a lot of people walking. Mm-hmm. Are you in, are you inside or outside? Outside. Mm-hmm. And are you there alone or is someone else still with you? By myself. Mm-hmm. How do you feel there? Normal. Normal. Mm-hmm. And this town, this place that you're in, outside, do you live nearby or are you just visiting? I live there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And what are you doing outside there out with these people? What are you doing? I'm just watching. Mm-hmm. Just watching. Mm-hmm. Are you sitting, standing, walking? Standing. Mm-hmm. And are you headed in any particular place or what are you doing there other than watching? I feel nervous. Feel nervous. Mm-hmm. What are you feeling nervous about? What are you feeling nervous about? For my life. For your life? Mm-hmm. Why do you feel nervous about your life? I don't know. Mm-hmm. What kind of work do you do, Emily? I don't have a title. I don't have a title. Okay, but how how do you work? Do you work? I don't make money. Okay. Don't make money, but do you... How do you spend your days? Doing what I'm asked. Doing what you're asked? Who tells you what to do? White people. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And your aunt and your uncle, do you still live, or your aunt and your cousin, do you still live with them? My aunt's dead. Mm-hmm. What about your cousin? I'm, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Do you? Who do you live with? They were white people. White people. Okay. 
So this place that you're in now, are you you are you in town or are you outside of your where you live? Standing outside of where you live. In town. In town. And what are you in town for? Going shopping with her. Shopping with who? With her. Who is her? Missy. And who is she? I work for. Okay. Okay. Right. And tell me what happens next with you guys there. What are you doing? In a store. Mm-hmm. What are you looking for in a store? Do you know? Mm. It's waiting. What so what happens next? Start start being mean. Someone starts being mean. Being mean to who? To me. Mm-hmm. What are they saying? And I'm, I'm no good. Mm-hmm. How does that help you? How does that make you feel? Like I'm no good. Mm-hmm. And what happens next? My hair get pulled. Repeat that. My hair get pulled. Mm -hmm. Is that by the same person who's being mean to you? Yes. Mm -hmm. And what happens when you're here? They pull your hair. I just let her pull it. Mm -hmm. And what thoughts go through your mind? Understand what I did. Mm -hmm. What happens next? What happens next? I just feel warm inside. Really warm. Feel what? Start from really warm inside. Feeling really warm inside. Inside where the part of your body you feel warm. Mm-hmm. What happens next? What's happening? The 
was feeling really, really warm. Repeat that. I don't, I just feel really warm inside. Like, the lonely. It's so warm. The room is warm. Mm-hmm. Well, are you sitting, standing at this point, walking? Laying down. Laying down? Mm-hmm. And how's your body positioned as you're laying down? I'm curled up. Mm-hmm. And there's yeah, the lady that was with you, where is she? He's over you. He's over you? Mm-hmm. And the other person who pulled your hair, where is she? Right there. Mm-hmm. Is there, she's still pulling your hair while you're on the ground? They beat me up. They beat you up. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let's see what happens next after they beat you up. Lady. Repeat that. I just lay there. You stay there. Mm-hmm. What did they when they beat you? What did they hit you? Everywhere. Where? Everywhere. Everywhere. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. As you lay there, do you feel any areas of your body that's been injured in any way? Back. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. let's see what the outcome of this is move forward tell me what the outcome of this is after they beat you up what happened what's the outcome can't tell. Mm -hmm. Why is that? Why are you, are you observing this? From what position are you observing this as it's happening? I feel like I just, I just feel warm. So warm. Mm -hmm. And once they stop beating you up, do you still lay there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Is there a moment where you get up afterwards? No. No. Dead. 